Hello, 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 hello. Welcome back to the main event. We, as you can see here, I got, let me move the gimbal up a little bit. We got, we got some theme, theme boosters. Um, we got, I believe, let's see, two, four, six, eight, twelve white. Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven, purple, nine blue, a grip of green, two, four, six, nine, uh, multicolor, uh, two, four, six, eight, ten red, and two, four, two, one, ten. 14, 16, 19 green. So, as as we always do, we're going to be opening these up color by color. And we're going to see which color is the best. Now, um, this is a, what do you call, a warning. If you are queasy... When you see cards being destroyed, this video is not for you because I am going to be destroying cards. I'm going to be cutting through um, to get to the good bits. So why do I do that? Because the cards are junk. You, you pretty much only get one or two potentially good cards. And um, in this process, we'll see, of course, if these are worth it and which color, if you were to go and invest in what you get, all right? So I'm just gonna start with the gold. Um, if, I haven't opened any of these yet. So, okay, so yeah. So, usually you're gonna be looking at the last few cards, so you get a mindless mech, worthless, as far as I can remember. Um, you get pretty much the same card in everything, so this is put in backwards. Now, if you cut very hard, you're going to be cutting through the potential good card. So, there's a mythic. I don't think that's worth much either, so, yes. And due to opening tons of these, this is the quickest, most humane method um, there is, and it's the easiest to clean up, because if you're tearing at the bottom, opening it, then you got to open the plastic, if you're getting rid of these cards anyways, then, yeah, it's worth it, and plus, you're cutting pretty much only the first card, that's the same one, I found that most of the time you're getting the same cards, the same rares, the same mythics, so, um, let's see, another thousand nine, that's the third one, I think, so we're off to not a good start, I don't think gold is going to be the winner, and then a mindless neck, or whatever that thing is, are vehicles making a comeback? I don't know. Security strip. And what is this one? Toad Rider. Um, I sometimes will look through because I have gotten error ones before where uh, you get multiple rares. Toad Rider again. These are pretty much... I don't know why they make these. Who buys these? Who buys these? I don't think these are even worth collecting, to be honest with you. Spring Leaf Avenger. Green is a total bust. We got one mythic out of green. Um, multicolor. Now we're going to go to white. What? What is a good white card? Oh, you can get the Wander Emperor. But instead we get the... 
Cloud Steel Kieran. Um, I hope none of y'all buy this. Total waste. Total waste. But this is fun just to see. Brilliant Restoration. Last time, green was the clear winner. You can get, um... What was that card? The Colossus or something. Oh, farewell. I think that's a couple of bucks. So I'm going to put that to the side. So that's a win in my book. Also, when you're mass opening stuff like this, you want to keep... Ooh, Wandering Emperor. Heck yeah. That's a good hit. Come on, give me... Nope. That, that just made it better. Oh, this is a good card too. March of the Otherworldly Light is worth something. There's a lot of good white cards, it seems. Usually white is the worst. Now, I'll admit there probably are some cards that are worth a couple of bucks, but I'm not looking for that. What is this? Lion Sash. I think that's worth something. I'm not sure. Um couple of bucks maybe come on wandering emperor three more left of white backwards come on okay a legendary land a couple of bucks white really seems like a good set to get. Oh, another Wandering Emperor. Okay, okay. White may be a good buy. Come on, give me another Wandering Emperor. Nope, Kieran. So, opening what? Two, four, six, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. White. And you get two Wandering Emperors. And this is, that is crazy. Wow. Now we go into black, which I said was purple. And a Toad Rider. I don't know, what's a good black card? Another Toad Rider. What is a good black? I don't think there's any good black cards. Is that Toad Rider again? No, it's a March of the Wretched. Ooh. Okay. That was a double. That's why sometimes you should look deeper. I'm gonna go look at that. Okay. The last one actually had two rares in it. Let me see. Okay. Two junk rares, but still. Alright. I'm going to look at this one just to see. Oh. Alright. I will now look more closely. So, alright. Let's go. Let's go. We got many more to go. Fighting Palm Ninja. It's like, how much does it take to... Uncommon. Soul... A vehicle. Anyone else invest in vehicles? Are they, they're, I guess they're making a comeback. Never got vehicles, personally. Soul transfer. And like I said, there's probably cards I'm missing that are worth money, but these are just ones that I remember. And we got the whatever that rat person. Second one I got. And Bank Buster. Nope. All right.
And Blade of Oni. Getting some mythics. Not worth much. Biting Palm. There are possibilities of double rares or mythic rare. So. And Biting Palm again. That is it for black. For black, we got three mythics to the Uni Nashi. White is still in the lead. Now let's do blue. Any good blue cards? March of the Swirling Mist. I don't even know if that's worth anything. Let's see here. We got Invoke the Winds. And these cards are the glossy cards. Smooth, glossy, mind link. Alright, come on, blue. What's a good blue card in here? Maybe a, a land? Thousand faced shadow. Okay, so this one is a double rare. We got Reality Chip and March of the Swirling Mist. Double the rare means double the strikeout. Yeah, I don't think blue is going to be even close. Reality Chip to being good. Green, you get, you can get. Oh, you can get. Um, what's that called? What's that? Gin Taxis, right? That's blue. Come on, give me a gin. Give me a gin. No. Come on. Gin, gin, gin. Gin, gin, gin. Uh. Oh, we got a key ring of the swirling skies. So blue is pretty much a strikeout. Now we're going to go into the green. There's tons of green, so come on, let's get a bow siege. But uh, seriously, wandering emperor. I think there was ten or something packs, and I was able to get two. That's good. Weaver. That is real good. Well, let me lower the. My wall has collapsed. Alright. I mean, you gotta get at least. Oh, here we go. Bo Siju. First one. I do have almost 20 of these, so. Let's see how many we can get. Nope. I'm still saying white. That's a pretty good pull rate for white. Come on. All right. I haven't gotten any crazy air boxes yet. Kinda hyped, got the bow CG. The come on again, come on. What is this? The Weaver. So it is possible to get it, it's just what is the pull ratio? White seems to have a very good pull ratio. Another bow CG. Alright. We pull two. I mean, if you're, if there's about, I think, I forgot how many I said in the beginning, but if you're pulling two, 
That's like a not still not a good pull rate. One per every ten. These things cost like what? Here, Jack. Jack the Ripper making his appearance. Jiki Jiki. Um, if your pull rate is one every ten, that's bad. Hey, get off my boost. Get off my. Okay, move. Get your paws off my card. Dang cat. If you can pull between five, I think the pull rate will be good. Okay, we got a key ring. Dragon. Whoop, sorry. Hit the gimbal. I can't see what I'm getting. We got a double rare there. Ow. Hey, I cannot see the cards that I'm pulling. Ow. Okay, look at this. Catch that get that on video. That's that's abuse. Do you mind? I'm trying to be professional here. March of the Burgeoning. Burgeoning. Alright, we're down to the last few. Oh my gosh. Move your ow. Move your paws, please. Dang it. Hey, hey. I'm trying to make a video here. Do you mind? Look at this. Look at this. Nine. Ow. Seriously? You picked this time to mess with me? Jeez Louise. That's why cats suck. Legit. Oh my gosh, he's just... Get off me, dude. Seriously. Not my cat, by the way. The kiddo's cat. Call me... I never like cats, I'm a dog guy. So, who else got a cat here? They are, he's cool, but the worst. Okay, Weaver. Two Bosijus, Bosijus, whatever you call it. I need to pull at least, come on, one more. And I think, it's going to be, oh, another dragon. Two more left. Give me one more. Give me one more. Oh, Yahtzee. Give me one more. Give me one more. One more. One more. Okay. So green, I think I had like 18 or 19. I can't remember. We did manage to pull three. And then, so not too shabby. I'm going to move this here. This one was. And then the last one we have here is red. What is good in red? Probably nothing. Nothing is my guess. What is this? Invoke Calamity. Maybe a dragon. Invoke Calamity. Please invoke. Okay, land. A couple of bucks there. Lizard blades. I think that's worth something. I'm not sure. Once again, I could be missing stuff. Um, these are just based off memories. Maybe like top 10 cards or at least the lands I know or something.
invoke calamity. We got a couple more to go, uh, four more to go. Red is looking like black. Uh, black, we got some new things. Red. Okay, there we go. We got a dragon. Overall, though, not good. What? Goro, Goro. Explosive Singularity. Last one. Not expecting much. Oh, sorry. And Thunder. Two Thunder Raijus. Crazy. Alright, let's do a quick review here. Red, we pulled two, four, six, eight, ten, which is they're about five ish. Let's just say five. So that's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 dollars in red. And then we pulled uh, two mythics, and this is probably worth maybe five dollars. So that sucks. Green, we got two, four, six, eight, ten. I think there's 18. So what is that? A shit ton of money. And we pulled. Three Bussy Jews, which are about 20 bucks, 20 ish, let's say 25, 50, 75, this is probably $80, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 85. Looks like I spent about 85. On average on that so not too bad blue total waste I don't even know that blue's a total waste blue blue you got one uh, black total waste white again we came up white was probably the best pull I think there was like nine or ten white and you pulled two wandering emperors um, this land so this is like I think one numbers are almost 30 bucks let's just say 20 Let's just say 30. 60. This is probably 60, 70 dollars worth in white. And if there's nine, 40. So that's a come up. And then multicolor, you pull, I pulled one black. So multi. if you were to get these and you were trying to pull the best cards, you are looking at green or white. Definitely green or white that is your best bet that is your highest probability that you're going to pull something overall total waste of money i mean how many you do the math we had probably 500 i don't even want to know how many hundreds you do the math i gave you the totals in the beginning there were about 10 of each color green had double so about 50 50 times five you're looking at maybe $300 worth and you're pulling maybe 150 worth of good cards. So once again, we lose, but pull rates for green and white are pretty good. So you can play, if you get these at a good price, I would definitely try your hand. Sometimes you can get two um, rares or mythics per, not two mythics, but two rares. Um, so white seems to have a lot of cards that are worth money. So does green here. So, um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. And the new set's coming out soon. So we're probably going to be doing this again. Wasting a lot of money. See, seeing what we can pull. So, thanks for watching. And keep on crack-a-lacking.